Hello, good evening. This is uh, Stardust 024. Uh, just want to talk a little bit about my Glock that I just got uh, a couple weeks back, Glock 19. Um, I bought it because I was going to take my concealed carry class, um, which I, it was the first time I actually shot uh, the new pistol. Um, and it feels great. Uh, the guy I bought it off of had uh, a lot of work done to it. Uh, you know, 3.5 pound uh, trigger pull or connector, polished internals, night sights, um, with the high vis night sights. Um, it's a Gen 3, um, but I'm used to my uh, Ruger SR9, which is. Um, doesn't have really anything done to it so um, I've noticed the Glock is a little heavier than the SR9 um, which is great for the recoil it grips a little shorter because it's the compact version as opposed to the SR9 that's the full size but uh, I just wanted to show you first time shooting it that I'm now a Glock fanboy as they say because this thing is freaking badass um, this is 15 feet, as you can say right there. See there uh, that we tested on. Um, we're supposed to shoot uh, uh, here in Ohio. We shoot. It's a 12-hour class, which sucks, but hey, whatever. It's good to know your laws and take your time. I'd rather do that than no class at all and try to figure out the laws later when it's too late. Anyways, um, so we had two targets to shoot at. Um, our first top target was um, 25 rounds. And then our bottom target was 22 rounds, and then the last three rounds is what you actually qualify with. At least that's how they did it. I don't know if that's a Ohio thing or whatever. Um, so on my top target, I was just getting used to the Glock, and that's um, my top target there. So that's 25 rounds. Um, obviously I was a little high, I think, because... Uh, I was still getting used to it, um, getting my breathing under control, um, and just taking the steps that they, uh, you know, were teaching me. Just it's a basic class. That's the thing. Um, it's a general idea. It wasn't too in depth on everything. You know, the basics. Because a lot of people there seemed like they really had not a whole lot of knowledge. Some people did, but I would say 30 or 40 percent of the class of 30 actually knew a lot about you know, guns in general, and what the idea of, a basic idea of what to do. So, and then here's my 22 uh, shots, and then my three to qualify, which, you know, obviously I can't tell which is which. I should have taken another target for my three to see my qualifying, because that would have been my best one. But, uh, so I think this Glock is freaking awesome. Um, I know it's only 15 feet, but, you know... 15, I guess, anywhere from 15 to 30 feet is probably going to be where you're going to need to defend yourself. Uh, even 30 feet is probably a bit far. 15 feet is when you know you're really going to have to do what you got to do to survive. So, uh, I feel pretty confident. Obviously, this is only my first time shooting the gun, and I need to get used to it. But, um, it, it's a good ego booster, you know. So, uh, obviously, it's an easy, easy functioning gun. Um, you know, so, uh, I haven't figured out whether I'm going to do stippling or not, or whether I'm just going to do talon grips. Uh, it felt a little bit loose. Maybe I just need to get used to it, but I think if I had talon grips or even, um, doing a custom stipple job myself, um, that would make it even, you know, grip a little bit better. So, uh, thanks for tuning in, guys. See you next time.